Welcome to Mastering and Guideline in Ultrasound and Echo. Hi everyone, here we have uh, right atrium. Right atrium, uh, like the left atrium, is another chamber of the heart on the right side. And uh, it uh, takes blood uh, venous from the venous system through the superior vena cava and inferior vena cava and drain to the right ventricle. From the outside surface, if you look at the posterior superior of the base of the heart, you can appreciate see superior vena cava and inferior vena cava connected to the uh, right atrium. And there is between the border of the, these two veins and lateral wall, uh, you can appreciate a groove that is, in, we call it sulcus, uh, sulcus terminalis that is impression of the crystal terminalis from inside that I am sh uh, showing you shortly. Like the left, left atrium, right atrium has a appendage or auricle too uh, that usually is wider, more triangular and bigger than the left auricle. Like the left uh, atrium, right atrium has uh, fourth surface or area, intraatrial, uh, intraatrial septum area that is smooth and has one at the almost center, a little superior oval shape that we called it fossa ovalis is remnants of the foramen ovalis from the fetus life. At around that fossa ovalis there is a muscular rim, we called it limbus and that is especially cardiac interventionalists use that one as a landmark and guideline for the uh, passing the probe. Uh, at the sinus area that is entrance of the both SVC and IVC, uh, is that is area is smooth too, that we call the sinus, those intraatrial septum defect, one of them is at this level happen and uh, sometime at the lower close the coronary sinus. Another structure we can appreciate in intraatrial septum uh, site uh, is that the remnant in some pay people still there is remaining of the fetus uh, life uh, that IVC has a valve, we call it ostician valve, it is very critical in fetus life because the blood on the IVC is oxygenated, come from the uh, placenta. So oxygenated, this valve is guiding the blood go more to the foramen ovalis, and so it goes to the left side and circulation system. And the structure that we can see below that one is coronary sinus and sometimes coronary sinus has a valve, we call it Tebesian valve and above that coronary sinus there is a, a triangle of Koch or Koch that is the area location of the AV node. At this level uh, you can, especially for interventionists, they are very familiar with this structure. At the lateral side of the or lateral wall of the inner side of right atrium, we can appreciate very uh, two, uh, prominent uh, pectinal muscle that is comb-like uh, bundle of the muscle. You can see here, here, all of them uh, end to the crista terminalis that you can see here, crista terminalis that cause impression of the sulcus, sulcus terminalis from outside of the LA. And finally, we have vestibule that is close to the entrance of the my, uh, tricuspid valve. Here we have other structure you can see. Oracle, uh, we don't deal in the echo with the oracle of the right side. But uh, especially in uh, interventionalists, they have to deal with those, especially in arrhythmia. I'm not going to talk about those structure uh, on this uh, presentation. Here we have uh, some echocardiographic uh, pattern 
and feature of the right atrium in apical four chamber as you can see the shape is a little at the base narrower uh, than the level of the tricuspid you can appreciate that sometimes you can see crystal terminal is here some of those uh, some of them is very uh, prominent and go all the way and we have to be aware of that is not the pathology is crystal terminalis at the short axis you can see here crystal terminalis here too tricuspid right atrium and here the entrance of the ivc that go angle this way if you angle a little fan in you can see it here we have snail view or bicaval view in the pediatric uh, it looks like pattern of a snail we have ivc ra uh, LA, not AL, LA left atrium, pulmonary vein, and artery, and SVC, the part of the tricuspid valve, maybe you can see, and part of the RV. Here we have a uh, transesophageal at the view for the intraatrial septum, this is the bubble test, as you can see, bubble come to through the SVC to the here right atrium, and there are some positive at, after pushing belly. You can see some bubble goes there. Here is limbus. You can see appreciate very easy limbus and maybe here. And we have IVC here, aorta there. For master group, I will have some uh, clips uh, more detail for intraatrial septum defect in pediatric uh, lectures on congenital heart disease and on TE for some uh, procedure. Uh, watchman all those stuff i am going to uh, uh, bring some more detail uh, material and lecture about the intraatrial septum right atrium and all other structure we go more detail up to the next time have a wonderful time